They didn't know the science of death. You remember, Jesus' path to the, to the cross is very different than the path of the two thieves. Jesus was so badly beaten, Pilate kind of feels like, hey, I, I don't see anything wrong with this guy. Tell you what, guys, I'll just beat Jesus to within an inch of his life. That'll satisfy you, right? It doesn't satisfy them. So now, after beating him that way, he has to go to the cross. Now, if on that process of going to the cross, he's starting to suffer circulatory shock, let's say, which is pretty reasonable given his beating, and then if he has heart failure, cardiac arrest, he will suffer one of two forms of effusion. Pericardial effusion is when water collects around your heart. But that typically is not a lot of water, and I've seen this in autopsies at homicide scenes. It's not going to be a lot of water to see a separation. But if you're in the right position, you'll suffer what's called pleural effusion, where water collects in your lung. Now, if you stab that chest cavity, you will see a separation of blood and water. Now, nobody knew that when John wrote his gospel.